RJ, pretty exciting news. You are a former representative player. You must be pleased to see the return of these games. Yeah, definitely. I think um, they, were, they were certainly something that was high on everybody's list throughout the year on, you know, when it came around. And whether you're a player or a supporter, people loved it. So it'll be great for the new generation to be able to um, experience what we did all those years ago. And Joel, you're obviously a little bit young, so you might not remember your dad playing, but you've heard some of the stories. Yeah, just I just like learning off the older players what they got to say to us. Like younger generations, like very good. We all take it all in and just show it out in the field when we go out. And Lala, obviously we have anti women's representative teams, but it's going to be the first time we have an anti FL women's representative side. Yeah, I think it's super exciting, and I know a lot of the um, women and the I guess the upcoming players as well will be really excited, something to look forward to. I know me personally, I've always wanted to get to that point but whether my body's up for it come that time I'll, I think I'll be involved in some way shape or form anyway but yeah. And with training club training starting soon you think this might be something that spur players on a little bit? Oh yeah definitely I know it gives me that little bit of fire and I think just just yeah something to work towards as well not just the NTFL season but yeah something else. Yeah, and final word with you RJ so um, young players coming through what are some of the you know names that have gone before them that they should try and emanate? Oh, okay. Yeah, no, there's a few, certainly. You know, Michael McLean, Mark Motlop, Mick Athanasia, Cyril Rioli, Morris Rioli, Dennis Dunn, Kaji Dunn, um, Noel Long. Yeah, yeah, the list goes on. We were pretty fortunate back then where we had so many um, great players that to get them in the one team was pretty special. And even to train with those type of players, and this is what the opportunity they'll get will be to we to train with players from other clubs and, and really get a good feel for it. But uh, normally those training sessions are sensational, so they'll get to lap that up, I'm sure.